if you are trying to lower your high cholesterol, here are some foods that you can incorporate more into your diet to do that. One of them is avocado and this makes a good addition to your breakfast or salad. You can just cut a half and throw it on there. It's very high in monounsaturated fat, high in minerals like iron, copper, magnesium and potassium. Apples are another one and you want to leave the skins on, that's the key. They're high in fiber, quercetin, which is good for your heart, and high in flavonoids and pectin. And basically pectin forms a gel in the stomach and this prevents fats from uh, the food you eat being totally absorbed. And uh, so they're very good for you, but leave the skin on and, and wash them. Raw carrots are another one. Fenugreek and garlic, these are foods that are high in vitamin C. And of course you can take a vitamin C supplement. Kiwi is also another one. This is high in vitamin C and it also gives you a lot of energy. And you want to make sure you're getting a lot of omega-3s like salmon, mackerel, flax, even grapeseed oil. Oats, like oatmeal for breakfast instead of uh, some pancakes or something. This would definitely be a healthier alternative and a way to lower your high cholesterol. Never, you never want to skip breakfast though. If you think that you're doing your body a favor by not eating, you're doing it a very big disservice actually and you are harming your metabolism and such. So don't ever skip breakfast or any meal for that matter. And something else that's quite good for cholesterol and lowering it is beans. And there are so many different kinds of beans, so if you don't like one, you can try another one. There's navy beans and kidney, pinto, black beans, etc. So you can try to even find some healthy salads or other recipes online that you can make with beans. So these are some foods that you can eat to help lower cholesterol.